welcome back to the card mat right little four ace trick well obviously you need the little four aces i'm just checking see yeah it is it's just going out of that's just all oh, right there we go now it shouldn't go out of focus i forgot to put my bloody lamp on again right so hello again and welcome back to the card mat yeah four little ace trick or little ace trick even does require the four aces nothing else besides a pack of cards you display your aces by picking them up pick the first one up just so that they can see the pip over your hand at the edge of your hand and pick the others up so you've got enough room to pick all four up and when you're picking the last one up you should be basically right on the corner with your middle finger and your thumb right as you're displaying the cards to the spectator like that which is then hiding the path you're just going to do a little bit of a card genie and just slide that card up then when you're coming down you're just going to slide that corner underneath the bottom most card don't put it up here put it underneath that card there and then you slide all the cards down onto the packet and you can show them getting squared up and you can do your little magic gesture and then you pick up the top three cards not spreading the fourth one and so you're now down to three and again you pop that in front and you just pop up the top card again it goes into there the cards will come down and you'll square up you'll do your magic gesture and this time you're taking two cards again display pop it up it goes into there you come down you square up magic gesture just the one card and show it's now just one card a lot of people might know what's going on when the four goes down to three because it's a couple of cards they might have noticed that a lot of people don't but when they suddenly see two cards there and then one card there they do start to think i hate them cards are disappearing there you get to this point you've got multiple ways of losing this card as long as you lose it into either second third or fourth place as long as it stays with them aces and stays upside down in the performance i just done the top change oh my hands are all horrible hang on there down there oh shoo shoo you just do i just done a top change to make it disappear i was thinking about keeping it the same where you'd pick the top you'd take the top card off and then you pull it in front and then you do that but you come back and catch that card in your hand as you then turn and put that down and then you can do i hit my lamp do a change yeah I'm trying to shove that again take it off get it in front kick that up but make sure you're catching that card underneath that card if it goes too far you're going to you're going to see it through the gap believe me from the front you will or you move this card too far over and they'll get a flash of that which is not what you want them to see so you do your little card and you flip up you catch that with your ring finger and the base of your thumb as you then square that down keeping the card obviously pointing towards them they won't see it and then you can just stick it on the top and do a color change or you could just take it to the front and just pop it up and then just put that down without flashing the other card and then it'll just drop any way you want to as long as you do get you know what i mean and then all it was then was just a turnover pass so when you spread them there they are in the middle all four of them the naughty things so from the top as they say you display one two three four aces have the pack towards yourself as you're taking these off it makes it a bit more suspenseful then you can show it to them so they can see the top of there bring your hand in the way flip it up pull it down square them up magic gesture one two three take them away they can see there you can show them there's only three you'll pop it up it'll go oh hopefully underneath there down square up magic gesture one 
two, take them away, shoulder two, pop it up, it goes under, it closes up, magic gesture, one, oh look, one card, put it on the top, do a little top change, oh my hands dried up again, a little top change, it's gone, and just do a quick turnover pass, spread the pack, and you'll find the four selected cards in the middle. And there you go. You can obviously start off with false cuts and false shuffles if you want to. You could also do a nice little card change if you want. Where you'd start off with the four aces on the bottom of the packet. And you just look through for four cards. And as you're looking through for four cards, you're getting yourself a little pinky count. Break over above them four cards. So when you took an out four random cards and close it up kick them to the side square the packet up you're going to pull them cards up underneath slide everything out drop the pack on the top turn over and see so we'll use them four random cards which just happen to be and gone the aces and then you go into it from there or whatever you fancy doing yeah and there we go i hope you enjoyed it Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again soon.